Hello friends, it's so nice you are again with us and today our guest is ISOS Q170MC motherboard. In addition to our reviews on modified chipsets for Intel Skylake processor series on LGA 1151 platform, now we're going to talk about a new innovative chipset for corporate solutions and namely about Intel Q170, which has succeeded Intel Q87. Intel Q170 is very similar to Z170 compared to its key parameters. Moreover, it supports the same number of PCI Express 3.0 standard lines, as well as USB, SATA 3.0 and SATA Express ports. Also, as it was before, it has available line allotment between PCI Express 3.0 to 16 slots. Since Intel Q170 is a chipset for the corporate segment, its key advantage is the technology support of Intel Small Business Advantage or Intel SBA, as well as of Intel vPro compared to Z170. Intel SBA is the software allowing simplified computer administration, and Intel vPro is a built-in security system which is designed to increase the protection level. It is aimed to achieve the following key objectives – protection against emerging threats including rootkits, viruses and malicious software, protection of personal data and site access points, user and corporate protection of confidential information, remote and local monitoring, PC and workstation restoration and repairing. As far as we had the new model for testing without package and supply set, then we shall immediately follow to its design description. Asus Q170MC is made by Micro ATX Standard. Its design is rather moderate and restrained. The only featuring element is the traditional yellow chipset radiator. The board component layout is implemented at a high level. All the ports and connectors have proper locations, so you will not have any problems with assembling and further system operation on the basis of the tested model. However, the graphics card with a dual slot cooler can hinder access to one of the Crossfire SATA 3.0 ports. The PCB bottom includes the following elements Front panel audio jack connection pad One of the two COM ports System fan socket and front panel connection pad In addition, we shall note availability of activation pads for USB 2.0 and 3.0 ports In total, the board supports 4 USB 2.0 and 10 USB 3.0 ports it is also possible to arrange this subsystem by means of 6 SATA 3.0 ports the tested board is equipped with 4 DIMM slots for installation of DDR4 RIM modules, which are equipped with latches on one side only for better convenience. Additionally, we shall mention the second part for connecting the remote panel with USB 3.0 ports. During the board cooling system testing, we have recorded the following temperatures. The chipset temperature is correct, but the processor power subsystem component performance appeared to be significantly higher, also it is far from crucial values. The GPU power supply is implemented by six-phase scheme for cores and other components. There are four PCI slots to extend the board functional usage, which include two PCI Express 3.0 to 16 slots for graphics card installation. Only one of the two connectors uses 16 lines, whereas the second connector bandwidth is limited by 4 lines. Therefore, if you install two graphic cards, they will operate by 6 plus 4 scheme, which will not allow you to make use of their performance to the full extent. Network connection support is implemented by means of 1 GB Intel 1219 L LAN controller. The order subsystem is based on 8-channel HDA codec Realtek ALC887. This new product has a very proper external port configuration. In addition, we shall note that you can mount two CAM ports and one LPT port on the rear case panel by means of appropriate pads on the printed board. The only drawback, which is worth mentioning, is the inconvenient multi-channel speakers connection. In this case, you will need to use the audio outputs on the computer front panel. Asus Q170MC has rather standard features for mounting a cooling system inside the computer case. There are three 4-pin slots for fan connection. The tested model uses a modern preloader based on UEFI graphics interface, where you can set parameters using your mouse. It offers two main operation modes. EZ mode, where all the required settings are displayed on one screen. 
or traditional advanced mode where all the settings are distributed by appropriate tabs. All the settings related to changes and by existing parameters are in the tab AI tweaker. Memory frequency multiplier allows setting the speed of the connected modules within the range from 800 to 42 and 66 MHz. If required, you can also access adjustment settings of memory delay. ASUS Q170MC has no possibility for process overclocking, and maximum frequency of the tested RAM modules has reached TDR4 level 2128 MHz. The tested ASUS Q170MC motherboard proved to be a high-quality and reliable solution for office use due to a number of advantages. First of all, they include support for Intel SBI and VPro technologies, high-quality of electronic components, COM, LPT and PC-2 ports available, as well as PCI expansion slot. As for special features which you should take into account before buying, we would only mention an inconvenient connection on multi-channel speakers and impossibility of processor overclocking. As a result, ASUS Q170 MC is a very good choice for its target audience. However, it is not recommended for home use because ASUS product line within the same price range could offer you a model on Intel Z170 chipset supporting the GPU and RAM overclocking. Subscribe to our channel and see you soon!